Welcome to Matters Financial and Geopolitical from a Frontier. Hope the week's going well. I attended the Africa CEO Forum breakfast brief briefing this morning at the Serena. And the first observations about the hotel itself, they made some very interesting renovations, reinvigorating what has been an iconic brand here in Nairobi. And uh, secondly, it was a really good function, lots of interesting people. Good to catch up with Brenda Mbathi, John Gumi, amongst others. Um, and uh, just hear people talk a little bit about challenges in Africa as we find it today. So thank you to Thomas for that invitation to that breakfast this morning. I did an interview with Simon Bransfield Garth, who's going to be my guest at um, Mindspeak on February the 2nd at the Moven Pick. And if you haven't responded, please do it immediately because it's really filled up very, very fast. He, of course, is the chief executive officer of Azuri Technologies, um, who are a solar provider um, uh, at, you know, at the rural market level. And it's a fascinating business. They've now bundled in smart TVs and all kinds of things into the offering. And a very interesting collaborative model that they deploy. And uh, that includes Unilever, APA Insurance. Do have a listen to this interview that we did. Macro thoughts, the dollar index is looking bullish going into the week, targeting 97.44, says T Commodity, and I agree with him. We're currently at 96.43, as you know by this stage. I'm bullish the dollar. That I, I'm very much in a minority, um, but I expect the dollar to strengthen about 10% in 2019. This tweet from J.S. Blockland got my attention. Global economic policy uncertainty is the highest on record. Trump, China, trade war, Brexit, Italy, debt, QT, 